Oh yeah, that's that's the field club in this P right there, man. Yeah. The 12. There was a woman, I think she was in Labrick Road and she was selling seven. She had seven of them from his collection. The 12 has got the um the output switches on it. This 12 has got the dip, the, these, these, these switches. So this is the only real that that one's got a bit loose a lot to like that up. But yeah, so this, this, this one, there's a quite a few, there's about, well, there's actually seven to be exact of these that were made specifically for Phil Collins. I have seen some other people do this, this, a similar mod, but this specific one was done for Phil Collins. And basically what it is on each, each SP channel, You've got a foot, you've got a, 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 a straight point, and you've got a filter point, so you can have the signals slightly filtered, and depending on what kind of sound you've got coming out. On this one, it's all labelled, and it will tell you exactly what what output is best for what sound. You know what I mean? So four is for the snare, five is for the clap, you know, seven hi hats, and how it does it. The lower one usually starts off with a more of a harder filter. So it's more of a lower filter, and as you go up, like the last two, seven and eight, are unfiltered. On the on 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 the regular un recipe, like on this 1200 here, you if you want to use the filter, you've got to pull the cable half half out and get to sort of balance it in between where it's meant to be to get to to to, to use the filter. But on this one, you can just flip the switch and you can use the filter. Like a classic one for the filter for me is you've got a kick drum with the hi-hat on the kick drum and yeah you stick the filter on there to, to, to kill off that hi-hat and then even it off with the EQ on the back of that but if you're using the right kind of EQ setup most of the time you're going to be doing whatever filtering you want to be doing on the EQ. I don't know how much they would go for on the open market nowadays. People are now trying to get, I mean, I did sell a 12 um, just before I came back when I got $2,000 for it. So yeah, and that's a 12, you know what I mean? So the price has gone sort of sky, skyrocket for SPs, but it's still a very specialist market. 